Hey guys, I'm finally back and I'm here to do part two to my fruit cake video for you guys. A lot of people have been sending me messages, requests, comments, begging me to, to put up the next part to my fruit cake, and I'm, I finally did it. I've actually been baking for the past week and I just haven't had any time to film any videos. So I just decided, okay, I'm gonna do it. So I did it for you guys and I'm gonna share it with you now. So I'm just wishing you guys a really Merry Christmas. Um, whatever part of the world you're in, I hope it's really enjoyable. I'll be in Trinidad. I think Trini Christmas is the best. So if you're in Trinidad, I know um, you guys can agree with me. So I will see you guys in my next video. And I forgot to tell you guys, I hope you have a really good new year, 2016. I hope it brings a lot of success to you guys. And just saying thank you so much again and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! So for this black cake you're gonna need one cup of sugar, granulated sugar, you can also use brown sugar. You'll need a cup of butter or if you're in the States you'll need two sticks. But in Trinidad they make it um, in one big block which is one cup. I'm gonna use some lemon zest. Five eggs. Two cups of flour or half pound. I'm gonna use about four to five cups of my soaked fruits and you can find the video in the info about. And um, you can use as much fruits as you like. Depends on how rich you want it. I want mine really rich, so I'm using a lot of this. I'm also going to use some browning, and we're just going to use about a quarter cup to a half cup, depending on how brown you want your cake. I'm going to use some Angostura bitters, just a dash of this. Some vanilla essence or vanilla extract. You can also use mixed essence as well. I'm using some rum. So good. And some cherry brandy. I'm also going to use two teaspoons of bacon powder and two teaspoons of cinnamon powder. You can also add nutmeg. I just don't like the taste of nutmeg, so I won't be adding that. So now what I'm going to do is cream the butter and sugar. And I'll show you guys how I do that. What I'm going to do is just cream it until it's really, really fluffy and nice. So for about 5 to 8 minutes. And then I'll come back and show you guys how it looks. So it looks nice and fluffy now. So I'm gonna start adding the eggs one at a time because you don't wanna risk getting any bad ones.
So now that the eggs are in, I'm gonna just grate in some of this lemon zest. You can also use lime zest. Now that that's done, I'm actually gonna add in the vanilla essence now. I'm just gonna eyeball it for so about a teaspoon and a half. Gonna add a dash of vanilla. About a quarter cup of browning. This is just basically burnt sugar. Um, it's used for like cakes and like um, stewing stuff. So if you can't find it, you can just look up a recipe on how to brown sugar to make brown sugar. Now I'm just gonna add the cinnamon and the baking powder to the flour. Just give that a nice stir. Now you want to add it slowly to your mixture here. So you just want to make sure to stir it in really well. Make sure all the fruits and the mixture, the flour mixture has combined. Now I'm just going to add about a quarter of cup of cherry brandy. And an eighth of a cup of water. I'm gonna pour these into my pans. I'm gonna place it in this Christmas tree pan and I'm just gonna spray it really well with some non stick spray. And just half fill this with mixture because this is gonna rise while it's in the oven. So it's gonna make two of these Christmas trees. And I have my oven preheating at 250 degrees Fahrenheit. And I'm just gonna leave this in for about an hour and a half to an hour and 45 minutes. And after that hour and a half, I'm gonna use a toothpick, stick it in, make sure it comes out clean. You can also use a knife. 
once it comes out clean then you know it's perfect so i'm gonna place this in the oven and i'll show you guys how it looks when it's done So this is the finished cake guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video and I will see you all in my next one, bye!